My name is Idris Lediju. I was born in the Cameroons. When my parents were there as traders, just during the first sector of the 20th century, my parents migrated from Iro towards Lagos. They settled in Oto, Ido, and Ebutemeta, and some of them who crossed over to Lagos was my great-grandfather. They first lived in a place called Faji at 5 o'clock, 5.30 in the morning. That's a gunshot from a papa. That is what the Lagosians used to set their watches and their clocks. That is 5.30. And that happens to coincide with the time the, prayer, the Muslims are saying the morning prayers. So that is the time for Lagos. And another gunshot at 8 p.m. That, so that is when the Muslims are having their night prayer. That gives everybody 8 o'clock. Most people, respectable people, leave the road as at that time. At the time when I was to go to school, we were generally admitted by the hair, hand, the right hand across the head to touch the left ear. Mine did not reach it until about the third time, and that was in 1930. And it was there that my age was estimated to be five. The cutter bridge used to be a wooden bridge, and I crossed over it when it was a wooden bridge. Well, as you walk along, you can see the water underneath it. And when that bridge was being built, during the construction, our house was not very far from there, so we knew everything about it. That bridge was opened in 1932. In 1939, the Second World War broke out. I was at this Methodist Boys High School in Form 2, and I was a scout, and we are taking, giving intensive training in first aid, because there were only two hospitals. African Hospital was the hospital for all Africans, and then there was the European Hospital. The social life in Lagos. One thing about Lagos when we were young was that uh, there was no discrimination about uh, religion. On Muslim, Muslim festival, the whole of Victoria Road, Nan Naziko, would be lined up with uh, people wanting to see people going to the mosque. They will walk from that central mosque right to Obalinde, and then people, those places will be full up of people dancing and merriment to the mosque. That is the Muslim festivals. As for the Christian festivals, they have the Easter celebration as well as the Christmas celebration. For the Easter, those people living in Ologbo, they came, they were also uh, repatriated slaves into Lagos, so that they came with the custom of the various uh, celebration of Easter from the part of um, America, they came back. So the social clubs, we had the, the, um, the island club came only fairly recently. They all came fairly recently. The Yoruba Tennis Club was the first one, belonging to eminent gentlemen in Lagos. The judges, Justice Adimola and all the rest of them like that. They played tennis and they called it Yoruba Tennis because all the Lagosians were Yorubas. The music for Lagos was Sakara. In my time, there was no university at all. The highest you could do was to have a secondary school. Lagos, still a very nice and then enjoyable place to live in. This is my Lagos story. 